thought while I were away things had calmed down. And, I don't know, Zoe would get used to being without me for a bit. But you don't think she did? Well, she was really getting on my nerves yesterday. I've had enough of her. And she must have missed you. Yeah, well, I told her the score before I went. As far as me and her are concerned, it's a fling, a bit of fun, that's all. Well, she don't seem to be laughing. Being away with Chris, it's made me realise, Chloe, I want him, I don't want Zoe. I wish she'd just leave me alone. So finish with her. If only it were that simple. What do you think I should wear then? If it were up to me, nothing but stockings and suspenders. Oh my god. You look sensational, whatever you choose. You've got legs to die for. I hope you're getting well paid to get your kit off. We don't all expect payment for services rendered. It's a privileged thing. Sounds more like our car to me. Oh, she's jealous. You will change the course of fashion history. Oh, do you think so? <laughs> yeah, as long as I'm not here when he arrives, that'll spoil everything. Right, best be off. Right, give me a kiss before you go. Mm. Oh, you've got strong stomachs. I've been collected on your way back from York. I told them you'd be there about half one. No problem. Hey up. Collect what? A surprise. I'll be off then. Yeah. Is this your idea of settling back into work after your holiday? Sending Terry off on secret missions? My, we are in a good mood this morning. You'd be better employed finding a replacement for Virginia. I had a sneaking feeling that you might have given that some thought. As a matter of fact, I have. And? I thought Charity could fill in for a while. What do you think? <sighs> You're recommending Charity for a job. It seems I'm not the only one planning a surprise. Yes or no? Why the change of heart? <laughs> you need someone straight away and she's available. When it comes to work, you never miss a chance to criticise her. Well, this time I'll be around to keep an eye on her, won't I? So what is it? Some sort of uh, power trip? Get it. Phone the agency. No need. No. I'll talk to her. You have to remember that you're the first point of contact for the business, and that can make a lot of difference. Yeah, I do know how to answer the phone and be nice to people. Charity's social skills are very good. And you should know. <laughs> Let's look at the accounts then, shall we? Look, Zoe, I appreciate what you're trying to do, but I know how Virginia used to work. I've spent enough time here. But don't be a spoil sport. Zoe likes telling people what to do, don't you? I want to make sure the job is done properly. Then don't make it sound like a lecture. Lighten up. Hi. Hello, boss. What? Charity's going to take on Virginia's responsibilities. Great. Not on board. <laughs> Don't get too excited. Sleeping with you isn't part of her job spec. You are. Not unless she does it on overtime. Not funny, Zoe. Oh, come on, Chris. It was a joke. Lighten up. I know you're the boss, Zoe, but I didn't appreciate that crack about charity any more than Chris did. Man with your reputation can't afford to be touchy. I think I've the right to be treated with respect. And so has Charity. OK. I'm sorry. If you need us, I'll be on my mobile. OK. All that fuss over one innocent remark. Yeah, well, I actually agree with him. What you said before was way out of order. I get the message. Look, let me take you to lunch, make it up to you. No way. If I'm going to do this job, I'm going to do it properly. Charity, if you've got a minute, Chris will like a word outside. He uh, says it's urgent. What's up? I think he'd rather tell you that himself. What do you think? It's fantastic. Try it out for size. You mean it's for me? Well, I wondered about jewellery, perfume. Thought you'd prefer this. It's absolutely brilliant. Thank you. Mm. Take it, Christine. Yeah. Oh, Zoe wants me to go over a few things. Tell please. with Zoe. You've done enough for one day. You didn't have to do this, you know. I've just had the best holiday of my life, thanks to you. You're a top bloke, you know that. Hmm. 